All right, through security, got the bag checked. Now, my flight's at 5.05 a.m. And my little sister convinced me that she looked it up yesterday and the airport staff was not even on and Southwest wasn't open until 3.30 a.m. I'd also got an email saying to be prepared for spring break travel and higher than normal uh, traffic conditions and longer waits. So I thought, okay, Stacy's probably right. Stacy, you were wrong. We got here before 3.30 and there was already a good line, but I'm through in plenty of time. So now it is time to find me some coffee. And it looks like the Starbucks is under construction or not open, but there is a Dunkin', so that's time for coffee. Such mixed emotions this morning, you know? Like, um, I cried a couple times trying to say bye to my dog. Um, on the way here, my dad asked if I was, he's like, how excited are you? And I'm like, you know, I just feel kind of numb. I'm just kind of going through the motions for now. And um, now that I'm here at the airport, it's starting to seem real. I think the real excitement will set in when I arrive in San Diego and Roadrunner and I are both there and our bags arrive on time. Um, I think that's when it'll be like really time to get excited. Plus it's also like 3.40, um, 4 a.m. So and I've only had a few hours sleep. Maybe that's why I'm kind of kind of feeling numb right now. But anyway, have a little bit before the flight. And I'm going to go sit down over here and wait by the gate. All right, made it to Dallas. Everything is on time. Luckily, my next flight is right by the gate that I came in on. So I have like 35 minutes until boarding. Things are starting to feel real. I am in San Diego. Oh my goodness. There was a guy sitting next to me on the flight that was uh, spending his, the whole flight, which was a little over three hours, working on a leadership presentation. And it really made me excited to be <laughs> coming to California to start the PCT. Anyway, Roadrunner's flight should get in in about 20 minutes. Um, I'm at the baggage claim right now, waiting for bags to start falling down. I <laughs> really hope mine is there in good shape. Um, I did find out that Roadrunner is coming in on a different terminal, so I don't know how far I gotta go to find her. But um, once I get my, my bag, I will figure out what's next. I got my bag. I was so nervous. I've been so nervous about this bag not showing up. Uh, I don't know why. But it was not one of the first ones. It was one of the last ones to come out. So I was starting to get a little anxious, but all is well. I have it right here. Um, I'm just gonna carry it over to Terminal 2 where Roadrunner is. That way we can go ahead and meet up and get our, our bags packed or repacked or whatever. Then I was told if I just walk on this way I'm going, I should be there in five minutes. So, so Roadrunner sent me a graphic because she had in-flight internet and she was tracking both of our flights. I'll insert the picture just in a, the end of this here, but she said it looked like our planes were racing. So um, I made sure to let her know at least I won this race. <laughs> She doesn't know I'm here, but I see her coming. Are you excited? All right, just outside of Terminal 2, we're gonna cross at the light. 
and apparently the shuttle we're going to get picked up on is right over there. We did learn for you. All right, we just walked across the street and it pulled up. I think that was uh, perfect timing. All right, everything has been very serendipitous. Like as soon as I got off the plane, one thing after the other, uh, like you saw, we walked out and the trolley pulled up before we ever got there. It dropped us off and we like immediately found where we're getting picked up to go to the terminus. But our shuttle's not for three and a half hours. So, um, we are gonna figure out something. We don't really know where we're at or what we're gonna do. I do wanna say, because I've not had a chance to, to thank him yet. We match. We do match. <laughs> and she bought pants, so now we both have gray pants on. We look ridiculous. <laughs> we're like twinsies. And I wanted to say thank you to Bob from Washington because he gave us some Trail Magic pre-trail and it was, Basically, it paid for both of our flights to get to San Diego. So it's a very generous bit of trail magic. So thank you very much. Also, thank you to my dad who gave me some, some trail magic before I left. And to my aunt and uncle, Sandy and Neil, for also giving me some trail magic before I left. Oh, check this out. Oh, thank you all it's very much. underpass. <laughs> but maybe it's a, a underpass to something cool. All right, thanks again, everybody. We're going to keep on walking and try to find at least something to drink, maybe something to eat as well. I don't know if the gray pants are great for dancing. <laughs> We just had a little bit of lunch at this little place here. We had, um, we just shared an appetizer sampler, but it was a good bit of food. <laughs> All right, we are here. It is about 10 till two, and I, I am waiting for the PCT shuttle. There are about seven other hikers right here now waiting. So hopefully they will be here in the next 10 minutes or so. And then we will head to, I think they take us to REI, a post office, and then to the grocery store in Campo. So we are get, getting very close. It's starting to feel very, very real. And um, I don't know, it feels real and surreal at the same time, but I am excited. I want to be standing at Cleef I was gonna wait till tomorrow morning to see that monument, but I don't know, I may have to go up there tonight. We'll have to see. I'm also kind of tired, it's been a long day. green store. There's the front door right there. Okay, you guys. And then you're like, not we're, all, we're almost there. We got everybody. All right, just got dropped off. Holy cow, I almost got the feels for a second when I just realized. That's signs for me. PCT class of 2024.
Do that again because I was zoomed in. <laughs> That's it? You're not going to write to 8022? No, not 8022. Why? Well, I was going to write the today's date, but it's not actually our start date. I'm going to write tomorrow's date. That's bad luck in Germany. You're bad luck, but here I am. <laughs> I wish they sold like smaller Oreo. boxes of tea. Oh, the, the huge boxes yeah. is all there are? I can't take all of these. Well, you could. Yeah. Oh, what is it like? What? 